Hello and welcome to the Storage Commander Network. This is going to be a brief beginner tutorial on how to complete a basic move out using the Storage Commander software. I do want to note that there is a variety of ways to complete a move out using Storage Commander software. So the first way I'm going to show you is by using the sitemap. Okay, first I need to find a rented unit. You can note that on the legend on the bottom of the screen that all the rented units are going to be marked blue on the sitemap. For this example, I'm going to use unit 75. Simply right click your unit and go to details to pull up the customer details screen and then go to activities and select vacate this unit. Another way to access Storage Commander's move out screen would be to do it through the Storage Commander's quick view. From here you can select a late or past due contract and simply double click to bring up the customer access screen. From here you can go to activities and once again click vacate this unit. Yet another way to access the move out options is to go to the customers and units tab. From this tab you can simply hover above uh, available contract and right click and select move out. The final way to access the move out menu would be simply to go to the move out button located in the upper left portion of your screen. From here you can simply select the customer's contract who you'd like to move out and continue to move out options. Now that we've explored the different ways to access the move out menu, Let's go ahead and move this customer out. The first thing you'll probably notice is the highlighted button prompting us to calculate our transaction. After we press that we can see exactly what's going on in our current transaction with this move out. Once we have confirmed this transaction with the customer we can continue to accept payment. As you can see this particular customer has a positive credit on his account of $41.79. Now you as a facility has to decide whether this is going to be given back to the customer as change or if this is going to be forfeited. Either way, pressing finish will end the process and this is how you complete a basic move out using Storage Commander's program. If you would like to see more instructional videos on Storage Commander, please subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit our website at www.storagecommander.com.